Okie doke. Let's see, I'm still getting things set up. Bear with me for a second. Okie doke. Let's see. Oop. Eh. Give it a dang old boop. Oh. <laughs> Hit the BRB. Oop. Interesting. Didn't mean to do that. Oh, man. Checking things out. Oh, yo, yo. Cool. We're going to get started over here. Uh, um, right. So let's do lobby play. Uh, change this down to uh, three since I haven't seen anyone respond about co hosting. So people was there. People was interested, but uh, I don't see a people. I don't hear people. So it's three for now. And I'm, I'm, I'm down for. Uh, Describe me as emotional. Yeah. The emotions are there. Facade, the emotions are there. You're, you're emotional, my dude. You are emotional. That's okay. We are human. We have those, even though some of us don't really understand them. But, you know. <laughs> I mean, you could. Uh, I would just, I would just have to explain to Crank later. But, you know. <laughs> I mean, officially, we just go through a process, and we're just like, okay, how do you know the things you want to do with stuff? All right, so we're, we're gonna we're gonna play a practice match, and you're gonna have to commentate over this, and we'll see how you do. And if we like you, say yes, <laughs> basically. <laughs> All right. Oh, welcome to uh, Scott Girls. <laughs> uh, knowledgeable enough? Uh, you, you know stuff at least. I mean. You know what's basically safe, what's not safe. And technically, that's almost enough. I would say. I, I'm, I'm, I, I'm not even like. I don't fucking know everything about this game. I just played this game a lot. <laughs> so I mean, <laughs> I learn something new every day. Um, but yeah. All right, everybody. This is the sound test. Let let me know uh, how volume sounds like. I, I want everything to sound as equal as possible between me and the game, since uh, I haven't seen anybody willing to uh, commentate in the dangled, dangled, uh, man, let me shut that in. Shut up, anyway, right. Oh. Cool. Glad it sounds good. Uh, oof. The, the only, what's that?
the only thing. Cool. Okay, okay. Hello, Guru. Hello, everybody. Just waiting for people to come and do the thing. Or waiting. Peepa was here, excited for the commentating, and then did, this is off doing other stuff, playing Shell Shock Live or whatever that is. I don't know. Playing that game. But, eh. Maybe they'll join in later. Whatever the case may be. I'm okay with rocking it solo. <laughs> Rick never lets me rock it solo. <laughs> Worms, but newer. Didn't worms basically make? Didn't the developers make new worms, newer, practically? Uh, you should dip for work. Uh, what's which one are you? So I know and make thing. I put you earlier. Okay, okay. Cool. Working out logistics. And I'm anime. Gingy. Ah, Gingy. I see. I see. That makes sense. Cool. All right. Let's let's officially start since we we basically got. Got things worked out practically. Okay, everybody, welcome to Skullgirls Get Great. For some dumb reason, I can't. I can do most of my inputs. That yeah, you know. I mean, you know, it's not. It's not that. Not the worst thing. It's just weird. Officially, everybody, welcome to Skullgirls Get Great. This Saturday event starting at 4 p.m. EST usually, but uh, fashionably late because fashionably late is really cool. <laughs> you know. Uh. So you sign up for this. We we attempt to match you up with players of equal skill. Give you some advice on how to improve what to do what not to do quote unquote what not to do uh because there's a lot of things that are just kind of ma malleable around this whole thing you can play the way you want to play but there's there's some guidelines to to follow that'll that'll ease you in a little better and uh make make your play uh much more consistent we'll say uh so no co-host today i i am rocking it solo unless people gets in here at some point or somebody else responds uh if not i'm okay with doing that Welcome to me, myself, and I, I suppose, <laughs> over here on the solo train. Solo A train. Cool. So let's get started with the dang old beginner's bracket. By the way, everybody, flat five matches this week. So you're going to do five, and that will be it for your your set. I guess we'll call it a set. It's not really a set, but you know. Um, so let's go, go on with... We have a requested match early. We go with Jinji versus dang old real robot. So let's, let's get these these dudes in here. Make sure that you're all up in the group chat. Type in the Twitch chat, GG8 chat. Click on that link, click on join chat. Then you can right click on my name and hit join game. And you can get into this dango lobby. How's everybody doing today? Everybody's doing okay? It's a, it's a bit of a cloudy Saturday. It's not the, not the worst thing in the world, at least. Spring is basically here now, which I'm, I'm glad to see. Because, geez, it's been cold lately. Also, that true. Yes, what Yo-Yo said. You may have to add me to friends, because Steam is being really weird with privacy things. So I have no idea what that's about. Uh, if you can't join the game for some reason, you might have to add me to friends. It's really, I don't know what they're doing, but I guess they changed privacy settings or whatever. Cool. Again, everybody, flat five matches. Flat five matches. 
I've never seen Jinji play. I played against a real robot, and they're kind of working on a Fuqua and Bella thing, uh, which can do a lot of damage output, uh, depending on the routes that you take. But we'll see. We'll see how they're working at it. They're, they're trying to work it out. Uh, ooh, Jinji with a 500 ping. Uh, let me know if the lag is too bad, if you experience any, and we can just split this up a little bit. It's rock and round start. What do we got? Tossing our fireballs with Fuqua. It's actually a good choice. You you want to start zoning as soon as possible sometimes, depending depending on the, the reaction that your opponent has. Spend the bar early with Jinji. Uh, Val Val kind of needs that bar. You don't want to spend bar as early as possible. It's it's not beneficial for you. And usually you just want to use scalpels to be able to confirm off of air grabs most of the time. That's not bad. He's got he's got kind of a handle. Uh, also with Valentine, uh, you do not want to start your your combos with st three times stand light punch. It's really really not bad for for your damage. Uh, ooh, like that. If it's an armor move, you get a sec. You can you get a you, you get a second bounce, or you get a, you get an OTG bounce. So you you don't have to worry about confirming it to BFF. You can just straight up confirm off of that. Um, but as, as I was saying with Val Valentine, um, don't start off with multi hitting moves because you do less damage overall. Uh, you kind of basically do negative damage and it won't necessarily matter. So what you want to do is start off with single heavy hitting moves at the beginning and then later on you want to go with go on to uh, multi hitting moves because that's the way that scaling works. Uh, if you don't know what scaling is or any of the terms I'm talking about, type into Twitch chat exclamation point -E rms terms and it's basically just an overarching glossary of fighting in terms that have some application two skull girls and a bunch of other games but uh not exactly mutually exclusive but you know at least help you understand some some of the things that i'm saying uh also careful about the raw tags you two Care careful about them raw tags adc okay you don't, you don't necessarily want to raw tag it as, as soon as you have a character that's bleeding uh the logic behind that is that if you if you do a raw tag and you tag it to the character that's you know full health that character can get instantly punished and then basically leave you at the same health level as the character that you were trying to help just save their life it's not not exactly the good good thing yet also indeed since uh, I see uh, I see both of these both of these guys are just kind of struggling with combos and stuff uh, head up the dangle BNB compendium type in the group chat exclamation mark BNB and that'll point you into the direction of a couple of combos that people have created uh, a lot of them by a uh, good old little pal Kyle Lugan. Um, they're not the most optimized things in the world, but they do give you a, a good direction, a good feel for your characters. Uh, like you know how, how they play, certain of the buttons that they use, uh, get used to the the way that it works, that kind of thing. Not bad for a first game though. Not bad. Not bad. Still feeling it out. Robots certainly still feeling it out. They're more comfortable with Bella than they are with Fuqua right now, but not bad. It's not bad. Tesla Nutty is Tommy Kinatora. <laughs> Mr. XD himself is shown. <laughs> it is very, very nutty. Very, very nutty. Oh man, <laughs> we're, we're trying to go for the the optimal combo. Yeah, that combo is actually really hard to start with. I, I've suggested Fuqua who, who want to people who want to pick up Fuqua for the first time go with the Shadow List first because trying out trying that combo on Skullheart is actually really hard. So. Mm -hmm. Go for the, the anti-air with Fuqua. The CMP is actually a really good anti-air for her because it's like, it's super tiny and it can hit a lot of falling buttons. Go with the raw tag. Get rid of the raw tags, but that, that's, it's it's okay for now. Ooh, that's basically a burst bait. Basically a burst bait. We're trying to go PBGC. It looks like a PBGC hard kick or something like that. Something would happen. Hello, Sam. Hello. Hi. Has it, has it like properly started? We have started already. Hello. Oh. It's okay. Though. I'm not gonna stay for long. That's fine. That's okay. Because I'm not. I'm gonna play Fortnite with Chris, but I just wanted to come and see how it was going. Okay. I'll I'll so play Fortnite said. with you guys after. I know. Okay. okay. All right then. Bye, stream. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Don't don't be awkward. That'll be great. That'll be fun. <laughs> there he goes. Thanks, Sam. <laughs> 
Hello, Joe! <laughs> Hello, Sp Spera. <laughs> you had some wombo combos at the very least. It's something. That's a birthday! If you kept on going with the combo, don't drop the combos, my dude. Don't drop those combos. It's important. Uh, that 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 uh, that confirm into JHK with Bella is kind of hard. Uh, you gotta work on the timing a little bit on that. Careful about calling assists kind of willy nilly like that. It, can, it looks like you're just kind of pressing the buttons and stuff, because um, that's more of a lockdown thing, and you can you can combo into it, but like you gotta be careful. It's not it's not the not the best thing about to be doing. Indeed, try to be blocking high if you notice someone is in the air a lot. Yes, yeah. Yeah, against Valentine, who likes to be in the air a lot, because her her air normals aren't... They're pretty decent, and they can also cross up a lot. Uh, you want to be blocking high often. Uh, and you don't have to worry about the assist call with Philia, Philia Hairball. Like, you could just block that high, too. That doesn't particularly matter. Um, yeah. Yeah, don't don't be down backing too much. For, for people who like to block, don't down back too much. I have that problem, too. I, I like to down back a lot. It's a, it's a habit to be getting rid of right away, as soon as possible. Just block when you need to, don't commit to downbagging often. Downbagging is just easy to do, because you can block most things, but like, don't, don't commit to it. Well, that was actually a really good round start with Robot. Uh, CHP into Fireball is actually a really good round start, because it's it's immediately round start spacing, and you win neutral instantly. Uh, if you if you, if you you combine it into to using Fireball, uh, you can confirm with BFF. It's like really nice, really nice thing to do. Double jump dive? Yeah, you don't... I would suggest learning the Shadowless with Fukua first, because that combo is really hard to be starting out learning. Like, I would suggest, because it's a, it's a hard hold as well. You, you gotta do... Hold Shadow into CHK. You wanna be careful about doing... Like, you, you, wanna, you wanna be... Cognizant of that link, which can be difficult. The hard tag, understandable. Yeah, she's bleeding. Oh, uh, so guys, you got you got to be sure that you tech as soon as you hit the ground and you see the blue tinge, you got to tech. So, whenever you hit the ground, there's certain different there's certain different colors that pop up when you hit the ground. So, if it's a purple, if it's a purple like it was right then, it, that means that you have OTG. So you have one bounce before you can auto tech again. If it's a blue bounce straight away. That means you can you can press a button and hold a direction. Well, hold a direction, then press a button, and then you can take which, whichever forward or backward. If it's a green, that means you've been hit by an assist, and you have to wait a couple frames before you can before you can tech. So you don't have to wait for a second bounce. Also true. That's actually yeah yeah. That's kind of true for most multi hitting moves. Um, push blocking Val's normals. Um, <laughs> you didn't know about the OTG sparks. That's a lot of thing that people don't have awareness of. That's that's like a, a subtle mechanic that people don't notice. Um, so you just you just have to be aware, and it's, it's sometimes it's a lot of information to dig in because it's like there's a lot of stuff happening on screen, but you're not and you're not looking at yourself or your opponent. So you just have to recognize it. Um, as for like val move and val normals and stuff, uh, it applies to actually multi hitting moves as well. It's to get someone off of you as soon as possible, push block the first hit and the last hit. Or at least as close to the last hit as possible, so that way you're not like in pressure immediately. You also it, it also invites uh, a PBGC, the push block guard cancel, for those who don't know. Um, if you if you happen to push block the first hit, you can you can cancel into a super or another move that's probably invincible or something like that. And you get a free punish. Basically. Yeah, you, you don't have the, the M Shadow cancels. The M Shadow. Yeah, from CHP to M Shadow cancel. It's really hard. Again, it's really hard. I would suggest learning the Shadowless first. Bypass loops? Uh, well, you already used, uh, you already used JMP, so it's not something you want to be doing. Uh, also, be careful about ending your moves on a block string with heavy, with heavy normal. Because it's usually very, very unsafe. We're also pressing off blood jump buttons here. Nice anti air. Yeah, yeah, we don't, we don't really know the, uh, the cancel. Yeah. Yeah, see, you don't want to be confirming it to uh, see apples like that. It doesn't really help. You're just kind of using a meter for no reason. Oh, uh, Atrial. It's dead Fuqua, unfortunately. Rip. And Abella. 
Also, you should be... Rubble, you should be push-blocking a little more. Like, you're just kind of holding the blocks. Like, you, you can negate most of the pressure. Like, you don't have to accept anything that... that Jinji is doing. Yeah, so, so like, all of that should be push-blocked. Like, you, don't, you do not have to accept any of that. It's kind of... You're just kind of holding it. You shouldn't be. And pressing buttons at the wrong time. There's a lot of counter hits happening, so you have to be cognizant of what's happening. That was actually a good response. I'll take it. That was a pretty good response. Cancel into that. You have to dash forward for that for you to get that. Like you, you need to dash forward to make that confirm. So that's that's actually pretty hard. Oh, that was almost dead. Oh, forward hard punch is not a good button to be using. It's it's a lot of startup, dude. There's a lot of startup. I mean, it's it's heavy damage, but way too much startup for you to be doing that. Especially against a fast normal like SLP from Valentine. It's not, it's not a good button to be using. You want to use that at like three-quarter screen or full screen for the pressure. This is not a move you do in someone's face. <laughs> oh man, Crank's online. Full stamp. All right, the last match. Showtime, what do we got? Hello, Hello Crank. ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Skull Goose. <laughs> yeah, great, I'm here. Crank, your potato quality, what happened? What am I? Your potato quality, Where what am happened? I? Oh. Oh, oh, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Skull Goose. Oh, oh, man. Oh. Let me fix that. <laughs> I gotta be far away. Hi, guys. Hello, Spiro. Oh, my God, you're in the background. All right. Yeah, she, she's uh, far away. I can't see the screen, so I can't provide commentary. That's okay. Here. You are potato quality. It's, this is beautiful. I'm potato we, quality? We will, we will keep this potato quality. Alright, we're here for a quality ass stream. <laughs> it's the best. I can hear you myself. I, I'm not that potato. I'm like... I'm like a tomato at worst. <laughs> a tomato at worst? Are you right? <laughs> <laughs> Are you on your phone? Is that, that, that doesn't mean much. Are, are you on your phone? Yeah. Oh, okay. I'm like trying to find a link to the stream so I can like actually contribute while I'm here. Oh, okay. Gotcha. I'm at level 3, the raw is still level 3. <laughs> Absolutely not. <laughs> can you hear her? I don't actually know if you can hear her. I, yes, I can hear her. Indeed, I can hear her. Okay. Alright, I'll be providing commentary from 15 seconds behind. Amazing. Sounds great. <laughs> yeah. All of stream and the uh, world can hear oh, oh, I should read the stream. I'm like hearing myself through the stream. God, like, yeah. there's no escape from our voice. There's no escape, dude. There's no escape. Boosh. Hit a BFF. That's actually a good decision. Can you, conf you confirm that? That's a confirm. Nice. Yeah. Go for the low reset. Not bad. That's okay. That's okay. You can watch it on time when I play. It's true, I could, but then I'd, then like all the audio from the speakers would just like come back into the mic and that would be bad. Yeah, no reverb. No, no. I don't like that reverb. Nobody likes feedback. Uh. <laughs> Nobody likes feedback. Ironically, that's what exactly everyone's here for. Uh. Oh, you're right. <laughs> we'll play it, guys. We'll play it. Not bad, not bad. Alright, so, so like an hour and a half ago, you said something about how if you're learning Fuqua, don't start with shadow combos. I just want to second that. Starting with shadow combos is the worst idea. It's really <laughs> Start with like just basic as um, jumping hard kick into um, hard punch, jumping hard punch loops. Yeah, it's, Those, it's a hard. They also do like 80% corner carry from like corner to corner, which is insanely good. So it's like not a useless combo to learn anyway. Yes, it's actually B and B that helps just overall with everything. <laughs> it's pretty nice. That's one of the main things I admire about Fuqua so much is that like all of her B and Bs have a purpose, even the bad ones. Yeah, dude. Whereas like with Squiggly, I can just actively say, "Why are you using that button? Why are you using this route? Like, no, nah, that's way too many airstrings. Like, there's no benefit to doing that." Um. <laughs> yeah. I right, just so then. She's ready to rock. Ready to whoop some ass. Ready to whoop some ass for the next match of Sparrow versus the Canwich. Dango Canwich. Oh snap, I can. Alright. Oh snap. Alright. 
So I don't want you to hear my commentary because it's going to distract you from, from your actual play. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Gonna be in a whole okay. other room for commentary. Right, so, this is, so this is a grudge match. Um, it's a grudge match, you say? Yeah. Why is it a grudge match? I Tammy Camwich specifically time. requested this match yes, because it she was, was so specific. mad at how hard she Tammy got wrecked. <laughs> By Sparrow. That's not, that's not how that works. Obviously, that's how that works. No, spare, Sparrow. That's obviously how that works. Oh, no. Okay. JP says this is obviously how it works. Oh, that was Raven. Yes. That's Raven. Yes. Oh, so you like the Raven Crank skin is perfect. <laughs> oh, yeah, you, you didn't watch the other ones. Like, no, I did not, unfortunately. Oh. Raven skin's the second best one. You can even hear the game. It's great. I still, I know you're here. You can hear the, oh, you're getting feedback for the game. Oh, I'll step back a little bit. As scary as it sounds, Absolutely. if you notice Philly just trying to IAD pressure, you can normally stealth with fast normals. Can do. If you're squiggly, you can jab out that Philly pressure. But most, most characters can jab out Philly pressure. Actually, I don't IAD. recommend, uh, I actually recommend using standing medium punch instead of jab. Can break out of Philly and standard dash pressure. Because but then you get the lower, vortex effect. Though? You do and get And it's also effect. a little bit better. Um, standing medium punch is not lower. It's slower, I mean, not lower, it's slower. Oh, uh, slower? Yeah, it is slower, yeah. but it's better. Um, it's more consistent, where the jab trades off often. Um, right. it's perfect with the jab out of it, but like, I don't, I'm not a big fan of it. Makes Some people sense. say you can use crouching light punch to do it, but as if crouching mm -hmm. light punch is useful for anything. That makes sense. Hemi with the, the bella oh, BNBs. That's you a full BNB. You got that mid-screen. Do we still have OTG? Out. I wasn't paying attention to the Yeah, sure, no, nobody used OTG for the pickup. Oh, okay. So that you have to be pre-jumping for that for that to not be a yeah. thing. So this is a Bella matchup kind of thing. Um, normally after you block two, like a light and a medium, you almost always want to transition into just up backing and getting out of that because there's like a 95% chance it's going to end in a grab. Until they start anti-airing, anti-air grabbing you, there's like no reason not to really do that. Yeah. Oh uh, hell yeah, we got that bow for the heavy busy. counter hit. We're oh, we got another heavy busy. counter hit, but too late another to press one. that second button. Oh man. Another one. Just keep being the Skelebones, it's fine, dude. We don't recognize she's I mean, Skelebones. <laughs> for reasons that are completely alien to me, mm -hmm. um, Sparrow's <laughs> not really had the time to actually practice ah. Skullgirls. Uh, yeah. I think a big thing that she probably needs to work on is just like pressing buttons a little bit more consistently. Yeah. Um, for example, like she got she hit with the second the first hit of the second <laughs> the first hit of the standing hard kick. Yeah. Um, but unfortunately, uh, she pressed the second one too late, which is funny because like normally if you use it in a combo, a lot of people press the second hit, second hit, oh, I like English, a little um, late just to do like a like a restand reset kind of thing. Yeah. Uh, it's kind of hard to convert off of, but it's a thing that people do. That being said, though, it's not a habit you want to get into. You want to make sure you're yeah. pressing buttons in a pristine way. You want to make sure you're not mashing. You want to make sure everything feels like an instrument. You make it feel like an instrument. Don't be like a lot of players Spare online. Just just with everything is mashing. So, everything mean, is now we know mashing. how she plays instruments. I see. Well, now we know how she plays instruments. That's she's played violin for the past like thirty years. Okay. <laughs> you, you think you can't <laughs> match the violin? Challenge accepted. <laughs> you could totally match the violin, dude. <laughs> oh hell yeah! I'm gonna outmash you so hard. <laughs> can't match as hard as Penny does in the piano. What do you mean? Yeah, your violin was stolen from you. <laughs> Alright, what's the round start? Okay, round start, round walk start. forward menacingly. Yeah. Walk, round start, walk forward menacingly. For Bella, it was a round start. Uh, so, this is a very common behavior yeah. tactic. Once you realize that you're really, really invulnerable to for all the startup of a raw tag, a lot of beginners, they like, get really excited really? and they'll be like, Oh, I'm gonna raw tag all day! And yeah. uh, that's exactly what's happening here. Yeah. Basically she says she's not doing it on purpose. Hello, but, uh, Sante. She's not actively trying to avoid raw tagging, so I'm gonna call that on purpose. <laughs> Just crank with the, with the relentlessness. <laughs> the thing is, like, even if it's coming out on accident, in all seriousness, like, you should be very extra, extra careful not to be raw tagging. Yeah. Because raw tagging leaves you super vulnerable when it's blocked. Mm -hmm. uh, lucky for Sparrow, Cammy does not know how to bait the reversal. She, it, it's really as simple as like, while you're like going ham on your opponent, just stop pressing buttons at some point. If they're pressing mm -hmm. raw tag like crazy, they'll very likely just be trying to mash out of something. An alternative thing you can do is just participate them and go for a, a scaled heavy counter hit combo. But I actually prefer baiting the raw tag because you get a real counter hit on the, But it's usually quite a harder read. And um, you're sacrificing pressure at that point, like if in case they don't do it. 
Um, which is funny, because that's how I get JP a lot. I'll just grab you, because you'll down back after trying to bait, like, out on, like, a raw tag or anything like that. I'll just stand and grab you, and you're like, why would you do that? Why would you do that? It, you're absolutely correct. The only reason I do it is because I know you. In a real <laughs> exactly. match, it's like a horrible idea. <laughs> uh, are we three or five today, JP? We are five today. We are five today. Yes, it's very few people. Crank not winning any brownie points. I mean, <laughs> when it comes to Skullgirls, it's serious business, okay, guys? Serious business. I don't hold back. Guys, you just wait till I pick this fucking ass of board games in two seconds. <laughs> I got really close to beating you in Sushi Go my first time playing. Yo, Sushi I Go so fun, dude. You cheated yeah. with fruit. I did not cheat. I cheated followed with the directions of the game. That you that I didn't wasn't told. I did tell you you did not listen. That's true. I don't listen. <laughs> I think you were distracted. Oh, was oh, I? Oh, ever? oh, oh man. <laughs> very distracted. I see. Hmm. Does Crank know any? Does Crank know my pad died, so I'm using a backup one. I do now, yo-yo. He's using it's an backup pad controller. Good. It's an x bone controller. Should he been not with the backup pad? I mean, the raw purpose. tag, totally on purpose. Totally on purpose. Jill's saying See that I'm right. correct. Um, that's very flattering. I don't know what I'm correct about. But I tend to say a lot of incorrect things. <laughs> well, you, you say incorrect things pre presented as fact, therefore you are believable. Absolutely. I'm very convincing. <laughs> That was really cool. All that assist and then using the sliding knockdown, you actually could have set up a really cool Oki thing, but you probably don't know what Oki is. So for those of you guys who are not familiar with Oki, Oki simply means like wake up game, um, which means like you get, put them into a knockdown state, so they're sliding across the ground or something, like they have to get up, and I'll use all that time you get for that um, to set up pressure that they'll have to block on wake up. And it's usually really, really tricky to do with it, because pressure in this game is a little oh insane. God. It's really hard. Oh, we're going. She, Spare is just going. Yeah. Very, so an, an example idea that I, I don't necessarily recommend, but it's just an idea, is you call your assist after you get like a sliding knockdown or whatever from your standing hard kick, and uh, then you also call horse. So they're forced to block lock the lockdown, and then block overhead for the horse, and then you uh, mash out crouching hard kick, and so they'll be forced to block high and low, and also be it'll be safe because you're crazy. True. It's very surprise because you won. Hello, Penny. Miss your face. We were just talking about you and how Penny? you mesh on the Penny. piano really well. Penny, I need you to know something. JP let out a big secret. We miss <laughs> your face. <laughs> also, I don't think you realize this, but you tweeted out your Christmas present. Oh. <laughs> so one of your one of your tweets is actually the Christmas present I got you, and I don't know, think you oh, know what same. it is. You, you you mash on your piano really well. <laughs> was, was it heck? heck? <laughs> <laughs> yes, absolutely, it was heck. absolutely heck. But it, that's the second part of your Christmas present. That's not the main part. <laughs> Switching to Philia. We're tied to Bella. I want the Philia pressure? Ten we don't know Philia combos though. That's unfortunate. Oh my! No, crank, don't, no, crank, don't put, don't 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 drink Kraken. No, crank. I'm not drinking Kraken. I'm only here for like 48 hours. Oh, we're here for I said a hacking hack. <laughs> I mean, like, <laughs> it falls into the same category, I think. I think hex included in hacking hack. Yeah. But it's like it's a personal awesome. opinion, though. <laughs> oh, man. Pressing the buttons. We're in there. Cammy doesn't even know what to do. Alright, going in with that sweep. Um, so, if you're, if you're using sweep from when your opponent is in like a standing state, uh, which means like they're not like flipped over and flying all over the place. Uh, that means that they'll be able to get up really, really fast. Like that, you'll see like as soon as they touch the ground, there's like a blue spark. And what that means is um, they have plenty of time to get up before you're about to do anything. Uh, that's not quote unquote optimal. Um, you okay. sweep is nice because it buys you time to think, but it's also mm -hmm. not nice because it gives you less things you can do off of it. Unfortunately. This is very true. Okay, I'm a sandwich, uh, demonstrating something that uh, most people don't usually do. Uh, if you happen to get OTG, and then you decide to snap them, you get your OTG back. So therefore you can just... Yep. You can combo, recognize that you were it was meant it, snap them out, and then continue. Yeah, it was meant as a tactic to be able to um, convert off your snap a lot more easy. So whenever you guys snap, you get your OTG back if you've already spent it, which is really interesting. I think it would be really cool if um, snapping gave you a second stack 
of an OTG, so I can push the counter up. Um, <laughs> instead of it just being a true false state. That would be really cool, but it's not a thing in Skullgirls. So it would be cool that you can like purposely route a two OTG combo after that. Holy crap, where said, are you? <laughs> I am a tomato. We're, we're, one step above, we're one step above the starch. We're into the fruit now. We're into the fruit. We're in the fruit market. Let's go. <laughs> I hate tomatoes, actually. I don't like tomatoes either. Can't confirm. I'm fan. not a fan. But you like cucumbers, which are objectively cucumbers worse. Cucumbers are amazing. No, they're they not. are objectively worse. Can't agree. Objectively worse. The JP's got good taste. JP says they are objectively worse. JP, you're dead to me. I've Fair been so dead for a long time, doesn't even matter. Doesn't even matter, he says. He's been dead for a long time. Oh, that's super sad, I think it's Oh, jeez. Oh, right. I, I, I can bring the life back to him. <laughs> I can bring the- I can relit- reignite the I fire in his eyes. Oh, she's gone full Disney princess. No, uh, gone full Disney, can't do it, copyright. We'll get- we'll get banned by Disney. We'll do it. Yeah, she's- her singing will get her- get our video copyright stricken. Because... It's super accurate. That's not true. <laughs> Challenge accepted. Anyway. <laughs> um, I was saying something in mildly important. I don't remember what it was now. Well, match is over. Man. Okay. That's fair. Alright. Alright, boy. Thanks, thanks for So a lot of it was just, like, mm -hmm. Spara, like, learning about the mechanics of the game. Um, like, yeah. how OTG should be used or whatever. Uh, oh, by the way, uh, oh, yeah, that's what I was saying. Um, so you can get a second, you can get an OTG back and then like use a second OTG in your combo. Um, usually you end up using it to convert off your snap, but it doesn't have to be the case. In fact, more often than not, you don't actually have to um, use your second OTG. Like, you, sometimes you have to spend a meter for it, so it better be freaking worth it. But it does get you a hard knockdown sometimes, which is nice because it lets you set up Oki, which is dirty, and so on and so forth. Yeah. Um, to digress, Sparrow probably just needs to work on cleaning up the inputs a little bit, like when it's a two hit normal. Just pressing it twice. Uh, she is whispering to me set to, about how she does not know what any of the buttons do. But Alright, she knows some of the buttons, never mind. Um, so never mind, she's literally she a pro at this some point. Of the buttons. I, literally I the back best. Everything I said. Literally the best. Uh, yeah. I would like to... Um, uh, from to Jill's you. perspective, aka mm -hmm. Cammy, um, mm -hmm. I would probably say... Uh, I, I feel like she needs a better... He, they need a little bit of a better game plan. Um... Because they were doing full combos, which is really cool. Uh, the resets that they were going for were really greedy, like the cost of meter and things like that. Uh, they didn't really have set play. Um, but that's not something they really need to worry about until like upper, mid, intermediate. Uh, from you watching them play, do you think that they're ready for intermediate bracket? I think they need a little bit more a little neutral more experience. Time. More neutral experience for sure, yeah. Yeah, because they just kind of either got a hit or just reversal and then got a hit. Yeah, that's um, what I kept on going. Next, let's, like, next week, let, remind me to put him up against like a slightly tougher opponent. And yeah. we'll see how that goes. Because they might be ready to move up. Because they got the fundamentals down, and that's the main goal you want to be have in the beginner bracket, yeah. honestly. Uh, I would like to uh, confirm with you guys. Uh, do, you, do you remember a giant king turtle? That is the man at the oh, top of I the uh, leaderboards in uh, Skullgirls. He's in the group chat. Yeah, they said cucumbers are the best and tomatoes are awful. Shaky says that cucumbers are the best. Wait, where are we? Oh, Shiki. Oh. Oh, yeah. Swagger. Swagger, yes. Freaking Swagger. That's Swagger, by the way. Oh, that's Swagger? Yeah, that's Swagger. Good, my, my son. My son got my taste of vegetables. Uh, question mark? Yeah. So those guys who don't know, um, Sparrow is Swagger's mom. Mm-hmm. That's it. That's all. Indeed. That's the lore. That, that is all. Cool. Let me, let me ping at N7 as we move on to Intermediates in Jerusalem. Alright, for those guys who are wondering, I will be back next week, all the way until Combo Breaker, yeah. in which case there won't be a stream. So technically, I'll be here for quite a while. Oh man, is that what's happening? Until then, farewell, my good friend, and oh, find wow. a co-host. We'll Penny's see. clearly here. Penny, co-host. Penny clearly is here. Can do, do the thing. Can do the thing you want to do it. <laughs> Crank, be my stepdaddy. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe this. Why is Giant King Turtle in the group chat? I miss I Giant know. King Turtle. They're pretty great. Yeah, they're really good. They're at top of the uh, Spill Girls leaderboards. They're in the group chat just kind of chilling. I don't know. That's hardcore. Yo, yeah. props to you, uh, Giant King Turtle. Nice of you to stop by. 
Anyways, farewell, ladies and gentlemen. Have a wonderful weekend. I am off to drink water because I am dehydrated. Thanks. Fair. Fair enough. <laughs> Bye! Bye, Craig! There he goes. Mastermind. Uh, so let's let's see if uh, N shows up for his matchup as we move on to intermediates, as I was saying before. And uh, people cannot join for a uh, co-host because personal issues, understandable. Uh, Penny, if you want to get in here and do the thing, you can. Uh, Swag, if you want to get in here and do the thing, you can. Yo, if you want to get in, to be honest, I'll take anybody. Yo, yo, if you want to get in here, you can do the thing, you can. Um, we'll just have to move to something else. I don't know. Just not the worst thing in the world. Um, but yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Step Daddy. Uh, so I pinged N. If anybody has N on their friends list, on their pager, in their CD player, send them a quick message and be like, yo, your thing is up. Get in here, bro. Otherwise, we'll just have to turn this into an open lobby. Also, something find me, Dutch. Are you right? Mechafritas. <laughs> Mechafritas. Well, is, he even, is, is he even online right now? Uh, I could pick him and be like, yo, you want to play? Uh, Mecha... He's not even online right now, yeah. He's not even online right now. Ripperoni. Mechafritas, not online right now. Uh, I suppose we'll just have to turn it into open lobby. I'm not going to sit around and wait, so... Let's get Murphy in here for the open lobby. Murph, where you at, Murph? Murph, get in the group chat. Do the thing. I saw you there. I don't see that you're there. Ah, oh, there you are. Okay. Went to game. Yeah, we might as well just make it an open lobby. Just combine you two, and then it'll be alright. You get to play twice then, Murphy. Well, you get to play him some more. Let me see what you got. Hurting is my wife. Yeah, yeah you're right. Hurting's pretty good. Takes you on dinner. Takes you out on dates. It's pretty nice. <laughs> fight, fight me IRL for the hurting. I don't know. Guru, Guru has the uh, the icon of the hurting right now. I don't know, man. Fight me in SGI. I knew that was going to go there. <laughs> Let's get a local going. Fight me in SGI. <laughs> Murphy starting up with the Fuqua point team. Okay. Let's see. I'll start Fuqua. Double jump backwards, do fireballs. Acceptable. Do not commit to ju double jumping all the time, though. Guru loves to do the uh, upward grab thing. Not for grab shenanigans. You just have to be. You just have to play your ground game, and then that's basically nulled. From that distance, doing CHP fireball while in the corner. Yeah, you really want to be in reverse positions for that to be a thing. To be honest. Or if we get counter hit, fortunately, drill like that is not worth doing. BFF is a better option. You, did you just take that? Did you just? What did you decide to not do? That's an interesting thing that just happened. Okay. Nice block. We, we need you to push block some more, Murphy. We raw tag into Eliza. I guess Eliza is a better option. You do not want to be doing the Osiris Spiral on block like that. Uh, unless it's like L Spiral, which is like minus three. That's better. See me at Combo Breaker. <laughs> Buddy, you both of you. I'm going to be at Combo Breaker. Fun fact, everybody. I will be at Combo Breaker. Oh, man. We got to confirm. But things weird things have happened. You do not want to be ending your your block strings on a medium like that. You usually never want to go past lights. <clears throat> because scratching lights give you the the best amount of like poke to safety basically. And it's usually a plus on block. So if you if you decide to go into a medium that's usually like minus six to minus ten, it's not worth doing. Just keep going with the keep going with the light pokes. 
If you decide to commit to like a whole block string thing, trying to make it safe-ish. I mean, I guess you could do that, but you still have most to deal with, yeah. Also, he's about to explode, so like, none of this is really worth it. Raw tag, I guess, sure. Yeah, yeah. Alpha counter into... into... level 3, yes, of course. We're in it for the memes, I guess. <coughs> Your hands are kind of stiff! Dude, you need to do, you need to do exercise, dude. Stretch out your wrists and stuff. Hit it up. Rondos. We stick with the Fugua team? Yes, we are. You hit 10,000 replays, we have returned. Yeah, yeah I, I have a lot of replays. I actually have more than 10,000, really. But, you know. Over the course of, like, the many years that I played this game. Into H. Decide to not spend the bar. You have to hold that. Uh, you know, if, if you're running butchers, you want to go in for the pressures. Like, go full block string, to be honest. Not Don't go for a crouch hard punch into fireball, because that's not going to do anything for you in Fukua. You want to go full block string, go go for a left right. I guess that gives you a mix up, but you could be doing way more, something much more dynamic with that. It, I mean, it gives you a reset, but I guess. Missing confirm. Yeah, you want to be grabbing uh, Guru at this point, because like he's usually committed to doing just HDP. Nice reset. I can't believe you actually did like a fucking pickup combo, chair pickup combo, that kind of thing. I'm surprised he's actually like picking up his chair more often right now because he usually doesn't commit. Like last night, he was just not picking up his chair at all. <laughs> yeah, I'm still not committed to picking up the chair. Confirm off of the assist into level three. You barely got that. Three hype picks up. No confirm. Okay. I I guess we're memeing right now. I guess we're memeing right now. Yeah. You could have level 3 out of that, by the way. Like, you. I guess. Game's not over till it's over. So, I mean, that would have been a good time to use 3 bar. I like how N signs up for this, but he just is not here. Just not a person. Off doing other stuff. Ladies and gentlemen, it's showtime. Round three. Go for the up back again with the fireball. All right. I mean, you need to change your approach at this point because, like, it's just getting pretty obvious. Go for the grab reset. Yep, that's a normal thing that happens. We'll be able. Okay, you can be doing something a little more dynamic with that. That's that's not safe. Like you don't need to respect that. You can you can grab that. Beowulf SHK is not safe. Not a thing you need to be respecting. Uh, that mix up you need to just block low high. You can you can absolute guard it. And absolute guarding is you can block low and high at the same time. Basically, if you push block, you can also do it without a push block, but it's harder. Um, but yeah, that's not something you have to respect. You can you can honestly up forward out of that. You'd be fine. That's not a good time to be using tier. Can't confirm. Nice block, but gets hit with the overhead. Yeah, again, you have to block low high at the same time. Hit it with the reset. I guess we just dropped the controller. Or something. I don't know. Yeah, he, he didn't even like... Yeah, there you go. He went for the memes. He came back with the... With the that. Got the pickup. Did the cross it. And we got our hype back, and then that just kind of happened. Alright then. Go with the memes. What the hell is going on here? <laughs> it seemed like so much fun while we. But yes, I'm sure. I'm sure it was great. I'm sure it was good fun. A dangle good old fun.
Make it flashy, guys. Action. Oh, three. Stand hard kick because a round start is not a thing you should be doing. Ever. Never, ever, ever. That is not a round start. That's not a round start option. option. That's just, that's just, I want to get hit, basically. A good round start with Fuku is what you did earlier in the first match. CHP into M ball, which you can confirm into BFF. That's fine. Do any variation of that. You could do fireball into a syscall, and that's pretty decent. Um... You could also do, if you want to go the SHK route, you really want to just do, use that as a car cancel kind of thing. So you can car cancel SHK into shadows. And that's a better thing. Yeah, with the BRB. Yeah, we just need to learn how to pressure with Parasol, this whole thing. See, at that point, if you're going to use uh, a diving egret, Use diving egret. You can cancel that into sniper, and that's how you get your pressure. If you notice that they that they block the uh, back HK with parasol, cancel into tears instead of the egret dive. That way you maintain your pressure, and that your plus on block at that point. Grab. Gotta learn how to take grabs, my boy. I take them grabs. Misconfirm. Yeah, you're not even dumb over that. But some things just some things are just like you need to recognize that they're happening. So like if you see if you see Beowulf go for wolf shoot, you just need to jump or press a button. That's you cross them up, I guess. If you want kind of if you want to confirm off of Liza level three, you can do CMK and that's fine. CM, CMK into SHP times two gives you that small. Uh, Vacuum effect, that way you can confirm into upper cats. And then from there, continue on comboing instead of going straight into upper cats, because, like, that's not going to do anything for you, really. And it makes it harder to confirm. So you can't, you're just kind of making it harder yourself using upper cat to confirm into some sort of long range nonsense. That you, can't, you, can't, you can't really do anything with it. So, like, yeah. The round start, we just back up. Fireball assist. Alright, yeah, that's okay. That's alright. We're going with the uh, really uh, meh zone from Fuku. Alright then. Push block. If you're gonna if you're gonna do SHK with Fuku, I mean you need you need dash, you need the momentum for that one. Like don't just jump forward SHK because then you're just gonna whiff. The bitch catch you say. The only the see the only thing with doing doing that shenanigans right there with a uh, saw is I mean you gotta you can you can sit there and not do anything but you can doing way you can be doing way more stuff to make that a little more ambiguous and, and like a little more powerful. I mean you can let it ride, but there should be more stuff you can be doing with it. So, so at that point, um, Murphy was jumping as soon as he called the uh, saw. So that kind of had to force a land candle on his part. That's that's how you got that grab there. Do, 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 do. Parasol's dead. Yep. Go for the cross up. All right, full and dizzy. So you could have bursted that. Like you did not have to accept that. You could have bursted that. <laughs> Go for the hard knockdown. He blocked it right. Yep. You don't want to be reverse swing like that too often, because then it makes you predictable. Well played. That was five matches. Not bad, not bad. Yeah, Murphy just need to, need to get your defense a little bit up there. Uh, you gotta recognize when things are happening and like certain situations pop up. You just need to you need to be more aggressive with your defense. Like you need to be more aggressive with your defense. And d don't don't start with this, Murphy. Not in the chat. Don't start with this. All right. The learning experience. Don't get yourself down about how you performed on stream. Just take it as a learning experience. All right. Take it as a learning experience. Just something to, to look at. To, to see where you went wrong, what you could be doing better, that kind of thing. Anyway, 
Onwards to the next match. Uh, Murphy, do you still want to do? You, do you still want to do your double lobby or? I mean, <laughs> leave for turning immediately. Just d does it leave for turning? Can't believe this. Can't believe this. I will just move on to uh, Yo Yo versus Facade. So Yo Yo versus Facade. Yo, a pretty decent player. Yo Yo rocking the spare the spare attack right there. Let's get Yo Yo in here. Get Facade in here. Pretty decent player with the Bella. I mean the Bella, the Squiggly and the Parasol. But rocking the Bella today. We're gonna see how that works. Facade, you just get in here, play the game, do the thing, rock it out. Still sponsoring me since Wednesday. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> Obviously because Crank betrayed you. <laughs> Facade, where you at? Otherwise, I'm just going to fight Yo-Yo, to be honest. Me, me poke him. They're up on get great. My dude. I'll also ping him in the Discord. At facade. Oh man. Where's facade? Dang old facade. He's also offline on Discord. Dang it, facade. Facade. <laughs> Yet you never hold her. Can't believe this. <laughs> strong independent. Hurting is a strong independent woman who doesn't need to be held. <laughs> you right. You right. So, Facade's in the group chat. But he's not here. It's also offline on Discord. So, give it like two minutes. And I'm just gonna fight, fight Yo-Yo. How's everybody doing? Everybody all right there? Everybody doing okay? Pills Eater is playing Skullgirls right now. Oh man. You see her as your wife who you don't play Bale. Oh man. Oof. Oof. With the comeback. With the comeback. Can't believe this. Yeah, it doesn't seem like Facade is here. I'm just going to fight Yo-Yo. That's the case. Bonk. Let me turn on my controller. Cool. Will my controller respond? Yes, it will. All right then. Okay, okay. Uh, let's see what I want to play. Oh no, there we go. Uh, what do I want to play? What do I want to play? What have I been playing lately? Oh, this. Let's hit this up with the. Scary Philia. There we go. Are you ready? Ladies and gentlemen, it's showtime. That's why you don't want to call the assist like that, Willie Nelly. So I'm not jumping. You usually want to use it against people who are dumping. No, oh, you couldn't even do it. You're brownie. Time to back up. So I want to kill. There we go. It's a really mean setup, by the way. Ooh. Confirms. Homemade combos. Alright. Looks like 
facade is here, so he'll get us. Yep. I thought about match. Yeah, your matches last, my dude. And we had we had people drop, so we had the one, and facade will have his five, I guess. <laughs> They get six matches, dude. <laughs> Go for it. Um, all right then. As for Bella things, uh, try not to commit to double jumping a little bit too much. I know that's like a carryover from like your squiggly thing because squiggly movement sucks. But Bella movements not that great either. But not something you should be committing to double jumping either. So like, you gotta you gotta be careful. She's got a good ground game too. And you don't have to commit to that. Nice land cancel for facade. Ooh, that was fancy. Nice. Oh, we're jumping though! Don't get caught by Accelibella, my guy. My dude guy. Ba 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 boosh. Nice. Bella didn't really take that much damage, so it's okay. That's acceptable. Bullia is dead though, unfortunately. Come, it comes in double. Double Bella can be pretty good. Oh, that's a birthday. That sucks. Ba ba ba. Oh my god, we don't confirm? No birthday? Oh, rip. Nice land cancel though. Oh, he expected him to go to the. Uh, I expected uh, Yo-Yo to be like, oh, it's, it's, uh, it's, it's going to be the other side and get hit the same side. So Lee is down, unfortunately. Nice cross-up thing. Uh, would have Maybe would have worked if it was timed a little earlier. Uh, nice. With the cross-up, we're at five meters. Well, not meant. Got things to do for days. Boop. Haba baba boosh. Into level three. You could probably combo into level 3 again as well. <laughs> oh, into level 3 and into level 1 actually, yeah. Because you were dead 2 meter. Oh, the comeback. Uh, if you do diamond drop, you, you can actually combo into forward heart punch. You get some Oki damage. Oki? OTG damage. That's the one. N was asleep. Doesn't even... Well, Rip, rip Roni, you missed, your, you missed your turn, sir. Missed your turn. You were you were trying to throw. You did diamond. You did do diamond. You did do diamond drop there. I did see it. You've gone too far, Samson. Gone too far, Samson. I'm sorry. Call the lock and load. That's okay. Kind of backing up. That's okay for neutral. He's still jumping. Recognize that there's an Accelibella, my dude. My guy, my dude, my guy. My dude. Otherwise, it's not gonna be fun. Nice double jump, that's actually pretty good to getting out of Philly pressure. But careful about the lock and load! Wow, nice confirm actually. <coughs> nice low. Go for the high low. Flock and load. Oh man, call the call the jump by doing a uh, man. A grab. Dead swiftly. Oh, unfortunately, that was a drop, but that's okay. We got this confirmed. Tag out into Bella. Oh wow. <laughs> Falling JMP for the, for the pressure. No damage. The forward heart punch. The OTG. Oh man. A little bit of a drop for facade. Nice call. Nice call. We can punish that now. Light punish because, I mean, basically dead. Oh man, King Turtle, Giant King Turtle, if you are watching, thanks for just hanging out in the chat, I guess. <laughs> it's just, I just found that interesting. 360 is with grab, not punches or kicks. It's with grab. Yep. USS, Ultimate Showstopper. Let's rock. 
With the ADC pressure. Oh, man. Careful about lock and load. Oh, we ADC into the other side, getting trip guard hit. That sucks. Let it build. Oh, get counter hit. Unfortunate. Whoa. The very light JMK pressure right there. It's nice high low pressure. Nice. That's pretty good. You're combining with Avery with uh, lock and load and the cross up. It's pretty good. Ba 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 boosh. We got the PBGC light punch, but not enough to reach. Oh, nice CP. Yeah, that wasn't a that wasn't real pressure. We saved OTG. Raw tag. Into Bell. Oh, it's not even raw tag. Hard tag into Bell. Interesting pressure. I guess he was expecting to get the hit. I don't know. Looks like he didn't. Oh, get caught jump. That's an interesting combo of sorts. I bet you can make that work a little bit more consistently. Nah, he's already he was already jumping at that point. Yeah, doing level three at that point was not not a good idea. Oh, you had you still had the uh, assist OTG. G. I mean, could have kept, kept going. Oh, get caught! The counter light did not recognize. Couldn't confirm. Sada with the five meter still not spending the bar. Interesting. There's a level three. <laughs> Caught him pressing a button. Man, oh man, oh man. Round four. Oh, Giant King Turtle's back. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it's showtime. We take out, we take out the Excalibur assist. It's actually a good idea. Tag the assist. Oh, don't let this turn into a birthday. It would have been really scary. Ooh, crouch slide. Oh, yeah, we're blocking because we stanceled early enough. Interesting. Oh, caught him with the ADC. No confirm, unfortunately. Oh my god, caught him dropping again. Facade, my dude. Would have been a birthday. Unfortunate. Fortunate drop. Nice burst bait. Oh, interesting. Huh. Could have done more damage off of that, I think. Caught him jumping. Must come up, and that's a dead failure. Oh, still catching him with the Salabella. That's a birthday. This is dead. Absolutely. Bubba. 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 Dead. The law. Unfortunato. Oof. Yo, you're having a rough time of it. Still getting used to Bella things. <laughs> A beginner level bad today. <clears throat> I remember. You're about to have a bad hmm? The Gorilla Fate is yearning. Showtime. The Gorilla Fate is yearning. We air dash forward and <laughs> back dash. Nice PBGC. We don't respect those those sweeps, dude. He was expecting the cross up. That's why you didn't block. Nice PBGC. Push walking super early to get rid of all that pressure. All that nonsense right there. I don't have to respect any of that. Twiggly is down. How do you go for? Seems to be like a some sort of like weird left right cross up. Interestingly, that made it safe, so you could not see. Okay. It did, was not enough range for that to happen. Get caught jumping. Can't jump with Bellum, my dude. 
Take you for a ride. Dead Bella. Confirm into Dynamo. Still getting used to the pet. I, I know. I know you're still getting used to the pet. I understand. I know the feeling, my dude. My guy, my dude, my dude, my guy, my dude. I know. I know the feeling. It's okay. We'll play to both of you. Yo yo. Get used to your pad. <laughs> Facade. Playing pretty well. Uh, weird, sketchy first few matches, but you just kind of have to get used to it. Which is, it seemed like you needed to warm up. So we'll play though. We'll play another list. Uh, so N managed to uh, make it here to the thing. So this is an open lobby. Uh, I don't remember if I considered an intermediate or beginner. All right, all right. so uh, I haven't seen N play in a long time. So I guess we could have like any, actually uh, anyone around like Guru's level, or I guess Murphy could also be in here too. Uh, but and any intermediate willing to play against N can uh, hit this up. Uh, so let me get in here. Do, 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 do. Copy page URL. No, 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 the link address. There we go. Huzzah! So we have N in here. Anybody who wants to play N can uh, just type in the group in the uh, Twitch chat. GA chat. Click on that link, click join chat, click right click on my name, click join game, and can fight against N. With his, with his, uh, little macaroni duggo thing. Is there anybody who would like to play against N? Anybody, any interested party, like to play against N? Switch the hitbox later now, join. Yeah, you right. <laughs> yeah, you're still a mod, dude. Yeah, you're still a mod. Again, this is an open lobby, so any any intermediate player willing to play against N can hop in here, click on that link, join group chat, or click on my name, join the game, and get games going. Let's see if there's anybody. I don't know if Yo-Yo wants to play again. He's getting used to his buttons. I think Yo-Yo might be actually a pretty good. Yo-Yo, you want to play again? You want to play again? Maybe Jinji wants to play again. And people who want to play again. <laughs> After this, we have to end. Oh, he wants to get in here. Alrighty. Oh man, Jinji, you just got outshone by Yo Yo. Ripperoni. Too slow on the buttons, yeah. Too slow on the buttons. By the way, N, and people who are watching flat five matches today, so you get to play your five, call it right there. And with the Philia, I remember N being a big band player, but I guess we're Philia. We're going straight for the, uh, oh man, with the IAD jump hard punches. Careful about using IAD jump hard punch, actually. Um, it's a little, it's a little spooky scary if you do that, because it's not the safest button. You really want an IAD with light, if anything. Ooh, careful, careful butt using dangle heavies on block, my dude. My guy, my dude, my guy. Got the push blocks in there. Ooh, that's a birthday. Ah, uh, we can confirm, unfortunately. That sucks. 
tag out the assist. That was hurting. Had the meter, didn't use it to punish anything. Oh, a little bit of lag, little, tiny bit of lag. That's actually a really good button. That was, that was pretty good, stuffing the air normal. Stuffing Squiggly's JHP. <laughs> I typed in he just hyperspaced at the lobby. Yes, he did. Ooh, nice light pressure, actually. That's pretty good. Nice. Tag the assist. Doing pretty decent, decently so far. Tag the assist yet again. We're doing it. Get hit by SP, unfortunately. This would be a good time to snap out for, to heal some of that red health. Nice empty jump. Wow. We had a punish. We had a punish in there somehow. Oh, raw tag. Get caught grabbing. Oh. It's a couple more hits to death for N. Dude, you're playing the slow game, which makes sense. See, he has no, he has no intention or no need to get in. Oh, we got caught. We got caught pressing a button. Oh, we just didn't block, unfortunately. Would have been a really good bait. Not bad. Not bad for not for not playing this game too often. For the opponent, hyperspace. You've gone too far, Samson. Everybody, mind your marks. Action. Round starts. Dash forward, CHK. Yeah, it's a little unsafe. That is a little unsafe. Um, to null the assist, I I am okay with. Wow, nice recognition on the uh, the reset there. Actually, it was pretty legit doing the DDC backwards. Get caught jumping. Don't jump too much. Don't jump too much, Australia. Just as important to have a ground game as you do an air game. Ooh, nice catch with the with the SLP on the diving woman. Go with the fall. Oh, hit overhead. Caught jumping. Into Excelabella. Silver cord. Burst. Caught dashing. Careful against dashing against Swiggly. She can just immediately sing it, SBO. Catches you and you'll feel bad. That is dead. That is very, very dead. And you get with a sweep. Let me see if you was online while we have these matches happening. Uh, oh, he's offline. Rip. Is he online in Discord? Uh, it's, it's Mew in it. Yeah. I Screw the stick. I'm going to claw D pad right now. Yeah, you right. <laughs> You should be. You should, you should get used to the D-pad. If you're if you played on D-pad before, get used to playing D-pad. It's it's not the worst in the world. It's offline. Ooh. All right, uh, Jinji. Uh, since you is not online, I'm just gonna say this right now. Uh, you is not online, so we're gonna have you play against Frosty for the last match. Just let you know. Oh, watch your feet. Oh man. Oh, and actually going to Big Ben Bella now. We're, we're tired of losing with Philia. Man. Oh, man. In a Mortis. Doesn't get the burst bait. Ba 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 boosh. That is a dead. Oh, man. No taunt. Decides to not get the taunt. Get the grab. Nice. Re grab. It's fine. Oh, in A train. Would have been, been pretty legit. Oh, no, all right. That was, that was an all right block string, actually. It's not bad. Push block. Push block a little too early, I think. Confirm in the copter. For the overhead. Ba ba ba. 
and playing the way he used to play. Nice. Ah, it's back in your bones, dude. You're fine. It's back in your bones. You're playing the way you used to play before. On two. Match four. I didn't even see it as I was just kind of watching this. Some man, he just went back to band. Ben, he usually plays band, Bella. Way back when, anyway. Nice push block. Ah, he's not jumping anymore, boy. Can't call that now. That's a birthday. That's unfortunate. We got the corner carry. Bonk. Ah, oh, you missed the confirm. Rip. And I knew it was going to be too far. Ooh, dash forward grab for the reset. Hard knockdown. Does not. Ooh, man. Doesn't spend the bar. Refuses to spend the bar. We tag the man assist. It's going to be locked out for a little while longer. Oh. Whoa, oh my god. What What just happened? We almost had to confirm right there. Oh, we're running Elbrass? Was that Elbrass? Interesting. Classic. Nice combos. Oh! <laughs> Light three times for the pressure. <laughs> oh, you're dashing. Oh, nice block. <gasps> Get hit with level three! Ah, oh, unfortunately, we don't have the main screen. It sucks. Yeah, you just press the, press the LP. Just press the LP. We don't get those stand hard punch confirms. Stand hard punch? Jump hard punch. Last match. And he's got it back in his bones. It's back in his bones. Claw deep at the such commitment. May I take On my favorite stage, Nightmare Crest. Final match. Let's rock. Let's rock. Ooh, that was a bad decision from Yo Yo, to be honest. Uh, ban Ban's option to go for Karch Hard Punch was actually a really good thing because it's super spaced at round start. It's pretty nice. Woo! Spook him with the uh, e break. Unfortunate. No confirm. That's okay though. Hits overhead. Almost a birthday. Cross up. And did not see that one coming. Really cross ups are a little scary. Spooky scary. Get hit. With SSJ. Get the taunt. We're in there. Almost had the confirms. Oh, and it's getting hit with the counters. Oh, I would have put that. That was a good moment to push block guard cancel over there, dude. Oh, that's unfortunate. Ba ba ba. Chupa. Look at Tuba, my dude. Caught crouching. It's very unfortunate. And taking that match convincingly. Nice. Well played. Well played. Ed's back in Ed's bones. He's just is antsy, antsy to play. Well played, guys. Well played. Not bad. And just be a little more consistent about your stuff. Jinji, ready to go. Let's get Frosty in here for the final match of the day. We ping him up in the thing. Oh no, he's he's ready to go. He's also ready to go. So we have Europe versus North America. Let me know if the ping is horribly atrocious. <laughs> you main main claw bet. <laughs> I don't think I ever will. I can't claw. I'm, I play tactical. I 
After I learn bland. After you learn band, so never. <laughs> Ginger with the solo vowel. There it goes. The upper grab. The raw bypass. Careful about raw bypass. Raw bypass is not, not that good of an option. Uh, again, again, careful with the raw bypass. It's not really a good option. It's a birthday! Ah, uh, we missed the bypass. You gotta be a little more consistent with your combos. Uh, do not do bypass on the ground when George is out. It's a bad idea. I'm just gonna, you're just gonna get hit. It. Hit by George, and that's not a fun time. Oh, for the same reason that uh, doing eight bang 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 on block is just not good. It's really unsafe. It makes sense if you're staggering it from full screen, but otherwise it's not. It's not a good button either. We got the elephant in the room with with red horns. I've never seen that before. Ooh, get crossed up by air show. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Could confirm it to Argus for Feces, for Feces to do so. There's the Argus. Get the DHC. Ba 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 boosh. That's a dead Valentine. Your usual pad is not compatible with PS4. With no converter? That, no matter the converter you use? That, that's, that's disgusting, dude. Which pad do you use? Which one do you use? Otherwise, that kind of just sucks. You might just want. You might as well just get a DS4. If that's the case. Yeah. Oh, the Logitech one. Yeah. Ooh. That does that just not work with a PS4 if you plug it in? Cause I figured that would. That sucks. So, ouch. Oh man, we're going toe to toe. 2v2 now. Uh, brown star SHK for Valentine is also not a good option. Like, especially if it's Peacock and they just immediately backed away. Commit to just one button of it. Otherwise, you're just going to get... It's going to be in a world of hurt. That's not fun. Again, don't commit to the bypasses in the air. It's very unwise. You got it that time. But you, you cannot convert that way. Struggling to keep up with his own. Give it the buttons. Again, careful with the bypasses in the air. It's not something you want to do. Confirms. The barrel into George. Drop the combo. Unfortunate. Downtown. Tag the assist. Really wanted to get to Peacock, though. No, don't don't do that. No, don't Gregor into George. It's not safe. And also, you just you just Gregor into a into a a bomb. It's not fun. Let's go around service valve. Jump back, dead cross. Patented by the spike. Be right. Come with a cross of dare show. Yeah, kind of. Okay, let's confirm. Oh, we need to, we need to we need to get our combos together there. Oh, it looks like we're trying to do each air ball, but we're just missing it. Best first super in the game. Yeah, you right, Gregor. Best first super in the game. Can confirm. Really is to be honest. Really is best first super in the game. <laughs> Take the band assist. Bang, bang, bang. You don't have to respect that. Careful about doing bypasses in the air like that. Oh, man. You're risking to getting punished. We take the assist. But we get hit ourselves for it. We also swap back to solo. Oh, man. Argus. Put them into the corner. That's fine. Use the bar. It's okay. Peacock gets it back immediately anyway. Beep, beep, bah. Oh. Unfortunately, dropped the combo. Push block. So you don't want to bypass in the air like that, man. Say it's safe. 
don't do it. Don't commit to the bypasses. Not even doing the supers, actually. The supers actually even worse. Oh, Argus! You can still super out of that. If, if you happen to super, you can still super again, because you're still in the, uh, the flash animation. Post-flash? Post-flash animation? I think that's what that's called. Oh man, up back, do the dead cross. Actually, a good option for Valentine. No confirm in the combo, unfortunately. You gotta do another bypass, yep. And then you have to confirm again into JMP. This is why you don't want to do JMP at the at the start like that. Nah, don't do bypass again. Don't do bypass. It's not gonna help you out, bro. Bang, bang, bang. Here's for George. Val trying to create some space, toss out them crosses. We're in, but not for long. Ah, uh, this is why you don't you don't do scalpels like that. It's not it's not gonna especially if you up back and do scalpels. Nah, it's not gonna work out too well. Ooh, that's punishable. That's a punish. You almost had the punish. Never mind. You got one hit punished. <laughs> Oh, if if you if you see at that point, it's just trying to recognize when they're at the corner or not. So you have to you have to take backwards for it. Oh, you almost had it. You have to you have to actually parry all hits of JMP for you to punish. Get him caught jumping. Level three. Unfortunately, you did it pretty late, so you you would have to cancel into Argus for that one. Sure enough, and the SSJ. What happened to SSJ? Pepperoni. One more match. One last match. Oh. Oh. Jinji, where you at? You at Jinji? Oh. Give me one second. Alright. One second. It's been one second. <laughs> Jinji's away for a little bit of a moment. Trying to sort something out real quick. Hey, there he is. Onward to the last match. Pro favor as well. Pro favor. It's pretty good. Camera's rolling and let's rock. The round start. Double jump backwards. Do a scalpel. Scalpel? Dead cross. That's the one. Again, careful about doing the bypasses in the air like that. It's not it's especially not good if Pe if you see Peacock teleporting like that. Like it's not gonna happen. Nothing's gonna happen for you. See JHK in the air for Valentine is actually a good option to do. Uh so in the interim between uh when the laser beams come out and the smaller laser beams, I guess you would call them, happen. You can you can do a super or a button of some sort that will make you sort of safeish, so you can punish that. Uh, as I was saying earlier before, though, um, for, for 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 Valentine, uh, doing JHK actually creates some good air spacing for you and punishes a lot of a lot of buttons. It's it's commitment, but it's it's good for space control. Downtown. Gotta be careful. Gotta be careful. And if you're gonna do a bypass, you have to do it in between the 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 mess that is Peacock's zoning pattern. There's like a it's like a dead zone that you can fit yourself into. Into the Argus. Also, Jinji, when you're when you're low health, you need to recognize when you need to snap out or not. So, attempting to get in, I can understand, but you need you need to snap out for health if you want to survive a little longer. I 
smell bread. Dude, she smells bread. Can you believe this? So we got some neutral stuff happening. Okay, okay. We got a vial loaded. All right. Doing giant step right there. Ooh, not a good moment. Go for the dive. Uh, I guess. We're poisoned now. Slowly but surely very poisoned. Taking quite an effect. Doing okay damage. Yeah. Not exactly worth doing the... Uh, super there. Dropkick again. Not exactly something you want to do. Careful about doing h brass on... On block like that, it's super unsafe. Like you don't need to push block that. It's not safe. See, all of that can be push block, but nice timing to the CLK right there. Well played. Well played. Ninja, please. Well played, guys. Well played. Um so normally we would go on to the end event of Skullgirls get great. It'd be the open lobby, but I've got I've got a couple things to take care of, so we're gonna have to have to call it here. Unfortunately, I'd like to thank everybody for who participated in the uh, get great. It's been a dangle time. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for signing up. Uh, if you're if you haven't had enough of our good old get great, uh, be sure to participate in our weekly tournament. Scorpios be great every Wednesday from seven to seven thirty. That's when uh, you can sign up for it. And you can, well, you can sign up for it as soon as sign ups are out. It's usually the day the day after the event, if not the the weekend then. Uh, same for Skullgirls Get Great. Signups are out usually day after the event, or if not throughout the week, uh, just harass Crank or Penny. Just be like, yo, you haven't made things yet. No one sign up. Uh, so yeah, thanks, thanks for stopping by, everybody. Glad to have had you here. It's been a good time. I'll see you all next week. Later, everyone.